what up, what up? Um, yeah, I'm Piers House Marie's, I write shit poetry. Um, I'm gonna try and keep this one short, cause, okay, I, I, I've got a list here, so I'm gonna try and read it out. Um, my hair's up now, look at that, it's a bit different. Um, as you can see, bits are coming out all over the fucking place, cause they're all different lengths. It will be back to normal in a few weeks, I'm assuming. Um, yeah, yeah, but look at that, right at the back, it's all pretty and shit, it's all pretty and stuff. But anyway, down to business, okay? Yeah, you know, I'm, I'm, I, 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 I don't miss my words, do I, mate? Um, yeah. Um, this one's an old one. It's called Forgiving Love. It's one of it's one of my favourites. Um, I'm gonna be a bit more. I'm gonna try to be a bit more enthused than I was last time I recorded it, because I was I was sitting down. I wasn't getting into it as much. Um, also, if you want to know more about it, go onto Facebook. Look at the old recording. You can you can see how much my style's changed as well. And also, I have more description about what it is. Please leave constructive comments in the section below um, and questions if possible. Um, oh yeah. I live in a commune, <laughs> which sounds like a massive hippie thing, and it used to be, but now it's not. Um, this is my room, but I've sort of set it up in a, in a delightful setting. Um, but anyway, yeah, on to the point. Josie Long played here last night, who is a, she's a very funny lady, and we, we, we were chatting shit for a, a few hours and stuff, but she's, she's really nice, and her, her, politi her politics are very, very close to my heart, and I think she enthused me in a completely different way. I, I, I was sort of losing faith in the political system, but she showed me that if you stand up and talk about what you believe in and say with enough, con enough conviction, you can, you, we can get a movement going. So if you have the chance, sign as many petitions as you can for stuff you believe in, go on, um, you know, protests, because it is, I mean, it's a big thing. We need to change our world for the better, otherwise nobody's going to do it. So please do that. It's, it's a big thing. Um, yeah, also on a completely different, unrelated note, but also a better note, I'm wearing red, so it fits the background. I, um, I, some, you can't plan these things. And it's also La Dispute. If you haven't checked them out, go check them out now. They're fucking brilliant. Um, I think they are. Give me your opinion if you don't, but whatever. Getting off, <laughs> getting off topic. Um, this one's sort of very, very loosely about not letting um, spite or like, fuck ups fuck up a good relationship, whether that's love um, in friends, family, you know, lover. Doesn't matter. So that's what it's basically about. If you want, want more more ideas about it? Go to the other one. Okay. I think that's everything. Let's get down to it. <coughs> there was a time when I stripped myself of your love, clawed heat handfuls from myself wherever I saw the remnants of your name, because I just got way too fucking tired of having to wear all those heartstring hard hats to stop those searching skill shots you steady aimed at my skull. To finally, clothed in my dignity, the only truly worthy gun, I went my own way. And now, I stumble idly upon myself writing love letters in the sand, tracing sad stories on the floors of this far too foreign land, which when read aloud, ring with forgiveness but strike with honesty still sting. I watch my lungs fill with slow silence, to perhaps in victory sing. And it's like with timid hopes after all these listless lifetimes, you still remember me for your hostage holding high, for you've never let my forget fly free. Yeah, I mean... The time that seasons this hearty meal, life, will only bring bitterness and disdain if not used effectively. And unless I wring that scrawny bird's neck now from a cold, dirty phone box which wearily shines any light out into the dark running road to discover and indulge in a heated self-evaluation with that plastic receiver and my own pride, I can tell that our next meeting will be decidedly less than the rom-com climax it could have been. And at that time was poured clumsily instead of sprinkled with steady efficiency. I will find the man that was me, spitting tired tenderness from the lines he reads on your forehead. After he left you forever ago, still ain't had time to grow. He will find you suffering from mad cirrhosis of the figure, clutching at empty handfuls of your own self-love and will watch his crow's feet complete stumbling sprints with the old metaphors of youth's love. That scowl is face paint that will never wash away. It's deep in the skin and you will hurt too fucking hard without it. Body creams, face creams, anti-wrinkle creams, old Apex Regenerist just ain't strong enough for that shit. So I will take my chance while the time is still sweet. And we will slow dance to the circadian rhythms that rock us into the presence of generic, mass-produced individuality as the floor convulses and the fires rage in this house. This house falls fast around our feet until there is a single wall in this wide open space between me, you, and everything. And hard darkness surrounds.
We will work together. You with your floodlight face and warm velvet words will guide the way and mend the shattered day and I... I can fly over these walls we put up to guard our hearts. I was so blind without the light in your eyes. And when we still fooled thoughts to thinking we were better apart and those walls reached deep into these dead black skies. See, they're still coated with the worthless words we wrote. While we will live to love another day and forever. So just turn on your smile and <coughs> clear your throat. And I'll take off this hard hat and rub my wings together. Um, that's always been one of my favourite poems. Partly because I just jacked like a few lines here, no, a few words here and there from one of my favourite Atmosphere songs. Which, if you still haven't checked them out, look it up. I'll hook you up with with the song that I sort of plagiarised um, in 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 the nice possible way. It's completely respectful. I am telling you that I did that, so please don't hate me for it. Um, it's called it's called yeah. I'll, I'll I'll link you. It's called Heaven Mess, but um, yeah. Um, I hope you enjoyed it. I don't know what the next one's going to be. But um, I'm still going to have to say. Yeah, obviously, check out the links below, as I just said. There is usually some interesting shit in there. At the very least, interesting, even if you don't agree with the sort of stuff I agree with. So please check it out. Keep, I'll keep you posted. Um, you can sign up to my Facebook page. You can subscribe to this. Either way, I'm a happy boy. Go check out Ladders Butte. Go check out Atmosphere. Go check out some stuff. It's, it, at the very least, it will be an experience. So. Thank you and good night.